which one of these characters has Batman not met? Harry Houdini, Voldemort, or Jason Voorhees? What? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone, and welcome to Stan the Normie. Hey, we're normal. Yeah. Oh, yes, I've yes, finally done yes, it. Yes. And you're finally a weird. Normal. Yeah, I'm a weird. Everybody, point. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I like Batman. That's why we're talking about the world's greatest detective today. And y'all will be using your detective skills to answer all of these questions. And we'll see which of you normies are the greatest of the normies, and potentially. A stand. Oh. 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 I, I never wow, thought we can of, join? I never yeah. thought Batman was like a detective. I thought he was like a guy that was just too afraid to kill people. Can, can mm. I be the sad, drunk Detective Gordon? No, <laughs> yes, you can be the sad, drunk Detective Gordon. Well, no, he's sad a, he's a, Batman, a, please, I'm sorry, I'm um, in love with you. He's a commissioner, <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> commissioner oh, Gordon. Oh, oh that's, right. that's, a, that's a floating point a bad there. start. Uh, but like, yeah, so we're gonna go through a whole bunch of questions and y'all will answer them. Whoever has the most points win. Y'all know how games work. Yeah. yeah. Are y'all feeling ready? Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, for these questions, I'm yes, going sir. to be naming some villains and you're going to have to choose the villain that isn't real, write it on your board, reveal it, and then after everyone has revealed who they think is not real, I will reveal the not real. So use your detective <laughs> skills oh. to see like Batman. who is not real. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like it. <clears throat> Can't you off your board? First one up, Honeypot, AKA Bethany Singer is a brilliant scientist who specializes in computers and identity theft. She also has a fascination with bees, integrating them into her digital traps whenever possible. Are they real or not real? Honeypot. Honey honey. Okay. Huh. You threw me off with the bees. Everyone let me know when you're ready. Ready. I think I'm so. ready. All right, let us reveal if they are real or not real. Ooh, Starting cool, cool. with Sage. Yeah. I'm gonna say real. Oh! I also hold, drew a bubble. Can you hold it up? Because I, I need people to see that bee. Yes. So, so, so I think it is real mm -hmm. because all of, all Batman women are, are really hot. Yeah. And you described a villain that sounds really, really hot. Mm, yes. Like, honeypot sounds great. It's We, we know the spy term, yeah. honeypot. Mm -hmm. And that sounds exactly right to me. All right. Good answer. All right. And yeah, Ian? I, I, I'm going to say it's real. Um, I have a similar uh, uh, line of thought. I think this was probably a Batman character that was developed in the 80s during the Cold War, mm. um, where the term honeypot became uh, really popular because of the spy, the spy action between the Soviet Union and the USA. All right, and Kimmy? Yeah, I didn't realize that honeypot was an actual term or a thing. Mm -hmm. I just thought it was the object yeah. and uh, food. Yeah. <laughs> so I said, not real. Mm -hmm. And I just feel like because of some of the villains in Batman, from what I can tell, there are some animal ones, there are some not animal ones, but I don't think it's a, I don't think a honeypot. Mm. <laughs> no, honeypot, no. Honey <laughs> well, Kimmy. <laughs> You are the only one. That is right. Oh. This was a tricky question because you yeah. might be thinking of Cobblepot from the Penguin, but you are right. That yeah, was that's not, what I was thinking. Yeah, that's <laughs> weird. This is where Cobblepot. not knowing Batman yeah. comes into Cobblepot. play. I didn't but want that to mess me up. I'm gonna tell you your next villain. <laughs> yeah. Let me know if it's real or not real. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Calendar Man, a.k.a. Julian Gregory Day, is a successful inventor, capable of designing the machinery needed to deploy his various schemes. His talents aid him as he pursues his obsession with quirks of the calendar, carefully planning and theming his crimes around holidays, weekdays, and the seasons. Real or not real? Let me know when you're ready. Ooh. I'm ready. And I visibly reacted too much. Wow. When he said yeah, yeah. I was like, oh yeah, you you know this one. <laughs> you just did the thing when nope. the kid kid finished the test. 
<laughs> Done. Yeah. I was so excited to know one. Yeah, yeah. Don't uh, don't ever play poker. <laughs> no one will let me. Absolutely not. I know that Calendar Man is real. I know it. I absolutely know Calendar Man. I couldn't okay. tell you a damn thing about it, but I remember how silly that is. Yeah, yeah. And you said, duh, totally. I said, that. real, duh, totally, because I know all about Batman, and this is my confidence in that. All right, uh, Ian? Well, I did play one of the Batman games, mm. and Calendar Man was in there. Oh, dang. So, I, yeah, I knew yeah. this one. Yeah, uh, Kimmy, it yeah. seems like you went against the grain when there were enough physical clues <laughs> to let you know that you probably should have cheated. But go ahead and uh, I, well, did, did it, don't put that but you know, I have. Uh, <laughs> oh, don't worry. I still so remember our goldfish video where you stole many oh, cards come from me, on. cheating, I did just not. looking I at my fair context clues. So it's funny you don't use it here. Rude. How dare you bring that back? I will show you. <laughs> I'll show you what I'm made of. I'm going to win this fair and square. Um, so, with this particular question, I was waiting to hear the entire thing because mm -hmm. I'm like, how would anyone know if this is real or not real if you don't listen to the entire description? But she heard Meanwhile, man. these guys are furiously writing away. So, I'm like, if it wasn't real, they would have listened to the whole thing. Yeah. I don't have to look at anyone's yep. board, but I uh. went with the real. Wow. Yeah, no, that's on. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, there it is. There I mean, it is. Right. Don't you don't make me proud. I mean, <laughs> that is Kimmy with two, Ian and Sage with wow. one. I am we'll getting get, my we'll get daily we'll lunch visit. We'll okay, okay. Crazy Quilt, no alter ego, is an ex painter who led a double life as a master thief. After being blinded during a robbery, he volunteers for an experimental procedure to restore his vision. Unfortunately, the surgery only lets him see in blinding, disorienting colors. He goes insane and adopts the identity of Crazy Quilt. What? <laughs> it's so stupid, it must be real. Well, let's start with you, Sage. I said not real. Mm. The name just doesn't sound right to me. There is something off about it that I don't stand by. I think it is not real. Okay, mm. and Ian? I said, real not. <laughs> 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 okay, uh, is there a reason behind it or are you just? Um, I mean, well, I was just gonna go with real, but then since I loudly proclaim that it's so stupid <laughs> that it, it must be real, then I was like, well, dang, now I'm throwing people off, so. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so then I went, I went with not real. Not real. But I have a feeling like it's probably real. It might be. All right, Who and knows? Kimmy, what is your thought? I just, what? Like, what is Batman? Like, what are these villains? They're so interesting, and there's such, there's such a variety of things. It just didn't make sense to me. I'm like, if he can't, if he just sees colors and he's always disoriented, how does he do any harm? I feel like he'd just be walking in circles, like confused about his surroundings and where the hell he is. Yeah. That's fair. So yeah. I just all don't right. know, I'm not real. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I just, I'm just glad we all agreed on this. We all this. agree. Yes. yes. We all yes. fail together. No. Yeah. For the yeah. first time, yeah. there is a unified front. Yeah. And for the first time, no one got anything right. Uh, it is a real yeah. character. How is he yeah. able to it do anything? It was too anything. crazy. Yeah, what does he do? Yeah, what does he even do? Like, Probably like that weird, like, you know, uh, like daredevil vision where it's like, it's weird colors, but I still see the outline of things. You uh, can smell your fear. I don't know. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's yeah. it. All right, we're moving on to round two. Yeah, 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 yeah. So for this round, there will be a list of special gadgets. We all know Batman for his gadgets. He has a utility belt and he mm -hmm. has little gadgets he used. And they're all starting with the name Bat for some reason. Oh. So, I'm gonna list some special gadgets for you and you must write down the one that is not real. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Once again, using your detective skills. Detective. First up, we're going through the Bat vehicles. Okay. Oh. Which one of these are fake? The bat copter, the bat ski boat, or the bat blimp. Ooh. I like the way you say blimp. Blimp. Okay. Some would say bat ski boat, <laughs> just for clarification. Those people suck, though. <laughs> <laughs> it's like basketball. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you ready? 
I'm ready. I'm ready. All Ooh. right, let's start with you this okay. time for this round. Kimmy, let's get it ripping going. Mm -hmm. I feel like Batman, I mean, I can't, I don't know if he flies at all, but like there's, you don't need that many flying vehicles. Mm -hmm. um, so there's two in this particular three choice answer. So I'm like, okay, it's gotta be one of the two. And Blat, Blat, Bat blimp. Uh, it sounded so ridiculous <laughs> that what I'm learning in this universe is that the ridiculous one is usually a true thing. So mm. I just went with bat copter because it made the most sense, mm. which makes the mm. least sense in the Batman universe. All right. That's good. <laughs> I mean, that's it. That's what I got. <laughs> Ian. I feel like I saw the bat copter in like some like random clip of like the oldies, like Adam West mm. uh, Batman kind of mm. thing. And to me, I, I said I said bat blimp because blimps are so useless. They're so slow. <laughs> they're always exploding in Germany, and you know, uh, it's just uh, I don't think it's a it's a useful form of transportation. And ski boats are sorry, ski boats mm -hmm. are kind of sick. Okay, well, people, if you're saying blimps are useless, I'd say people who play WoW for the Horde would have some things to oh, say with you. Wow, you. Am I right just for our, the Horde? Our blimp fans. Yeah, I'm sorry, Horde. <laughs> My God. It's, it all lands on you now, so. Now I'm trying to get all three on the board here. Oh, really? Because I went with the bat ski boat. Oh, <laughs> you said wow! Ski. 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 Not ski as in ski. Ooh. Ski. Ah, ski, um, ski, okay, ski, ski, so ski, ski, uh, somewhere in my brain told me that I remember there being a bat blimp for how ridiculous it is. Yes. Bat copter also sounds vaguely familiar, but what I really went off of is that you sounded the least familiar with the bat ski boat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you're the one who's supposed to know this. Mm -hmm. So okay. if I get it wrong, it's really that you got yeah, it wrong. I, yeah, I feel I, don't good worry. about that. You didn't have to clarify. I really picked it up from the moment you said that. <laughs> now, That's my answer. So we have three different answers. No, we don't. <laughs> Which means. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. I'm That's not crazy. Moving. Did I'm... I say blimp? Uh, <laughs> Did I say blimp? Okay, we have two answers on the board. No, yeah. no. No, we'll, okay. no, I'll let it happen. We have two answers on we the board. Wrong. That means I got it wrong anyway. So two batsky boats. No, no. One bat didn't. copter. No, two batsky boats. One bat it's copter. She got it. Two batsky boats. <laughs> it was the bat blimp. <laughs> hey! uh, yes! Which means, yes, Ian, I will veto the change. You did get okay, Bat Blimp. Okay. That means it's two for Kimmy, two for Ian, one for Sage. Good job. Tearing Ian. it up right now. <laughs> All right, we got some more bad gadgets. Yeah. Bat Are y'all ready? Yes. Yeah. Oh, Bat Credit Card. An Amex with a seemingly endless limit. That's just a black card. Uh, <laughs> Bat Boy, a custom handheld game console created for Robin, or Bat Makeup, a makeup kit Batman uses to change his appearance. What? What? Oh. Yeah. Wait, so only one is not real? Only one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, only one of these are not real. Insanity. Okay, oh God. All right, Kimmy, are you ready to reveal? It seems like you're ha you have it down. I have something down. Yeah. So we'll start with you. Well, these all don't sound real. I I don't know. Um, I a bat card. Yeah, it makes sense. I feel like to have that fancy, um, what's it called, his bat cave and stuff. You know, you need to have a lot of mm -hmm. cashola on hand and oh, yeah. seem, set, like seeming seemingly endless amounts of money to spend. Bat makeup. I'm like he he does have to change his appearance sometimes, so that kind of makes sense to me. There was only one that was a bat product, but not for him, yeah. you know? Which doesn't, like, why would it be called a bat boy? Would yeah. it be a Robin boy? Or like, yeah. so I went with bat boy. Ooh, okay. interesting <laughs> deduction there. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see uh, what you went with, Ian. Bat Boy was one that made sense because it's like, <laughs> it's fulfilling like every kid's fantasy to have like a video game console of their yeah. own. I agree, it should have been called a Robin Boy. Right? Bruce Willis? Bruce Willis. Bruce mm -hmm. Willis. The most famous about uh, <laughs> Is already like rich as shit. Does he really need a card that has unlimited limit? Oh. oh. Oh, I didn't even notice. Credit. 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 I guess I was. So, so, yeah, yeah, it's, it's like period. Oh, <laughs> nice, save. Yeah, nice. yeah, there it is. We... <laughs> Once again, I have not agreed with either of them. Ooh. Oh, ooh, ooh. And I went with bat makeup. Okay. There are question marks all yes. over this board. Uh, I've got a lot of questions yeah. here. Okay, he wears a mask. Mm. Why would he need the makeup? Oh. I don't, like, he's in disguise. 
I think that if he did have makeup too, I think that toxic masculinity in comic books would not allow no, him to have his too. own makeup true, 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 true. set, true. and they wouldn't acknowledge the makeup of it even if he was in disguise, so I went with that makeup. Oh man, that, that is that another is set of solid deductions. <laughs> that was great. Once again, since all three of you have three different answers, that means only one of you are correct. The correct answer is indeed the Bat Boy. It is the Bat Boy. Whoa! 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 Yes. Yes. I didn't even realize yes. until I was yes. yes. I thought wow. like toxic masculinity wouldn't Batman. allow Batman oh, well, to like Oh, Batman has been going against <laughs> yes. it. He also he also poses and dresses. He was the bad bunny before there was bad bunny. He was <laughs> bad bunny. Uh, bad wow. bad. Uh, gotta stop using logic. Yes. So we're jumping into round three, and as a tally of the scores, we have Kimmy with three points, Yay. Ian Batman. with two points, and Sage coming up the rear with one point, but it's anyone's game. It's because anyone's we have game. One it really is. More, it really is. <laughs> one more category. One more. This one is called Crossover Palooza. Oh. We will list characters, one of them who hasn't met Batman. This is what we like to do is spice things up oh. and add <laughs> three points to the last question. Meaning okay. that this gives a chance for the people behind to come ahead or the people up top to go even further. Plus ultra. Yep. It all stops, starts, ends, begins here. This is the alpha and omega. <laughs> yep. Okay. This is the, the final question. Which one of these characters has Batman not met? Harry Houdini. Voldemort or Jason Voorhees? What? <laughs> <laughs> Which of these? Three? Only one of these Batman has not met. Excuse me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure, yeah. Yeah, this is definitely sensical. <laughs> To, to, keep, keep, to keep your brain, your brain <sighs> spicy, here's two characters he has met that we took out. Okay. The Predator <laughs> and the Power Rangers. What is this? What is this world? <laughs> is everyone ready? Yes, yeah. sir. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I want to start with you, Ian. Uh, well, I, I just went with this because I feel like it's the newest property and we would have seen something about it. I went with Voldemort. Mm. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Sage. I also went with Voldemort, and then mm. I drew an angry little note, like flat nose oh, Voldemort. Yeah. Oh, Voldemort. Very good. Yeah. Very good. yeah. Very good. Um, now I struggled with it because I know that they are both WB properties, and that threw me off. But again, it's the same thing. I feel like I would have known mm. if there was a Harry Potter crossover, and it doesn't lend itself as well to doing something like animated. Without, like, we would know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think we would know. Kimmy. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have similar uh, rationale to these guys. It's just it, it's the new it's the newest of the three. It just I feel like there's a real tight like lock and key on like Harry Potter stuff, and it's mm -hmm. pretty limited the expanse to which they use those characters. Mm -hmm. Like I feel like even like merchandise and like actual it's it's such a popular brand that is it, it a, feel is it a lock and key or is people just slowly distancing themselves from the property because the True. creator keeps saying dumb shit. The the lock and key is the lock and key is for everyone that's not a part of the brand currently. Yeah. Everyone else that's distancing themselves. Yeah, they were like, no way. <laughs> Not with the ten foot pole. Um, um, so yeah, I'm gonna go with Voldemort as well. Ooh, Ooh, with we're Voldemort, <laughs> the one whose name should not be spoken. <laughs> Is that how you wake up your dog? <laughs> <laughs> the question, the Alpha Omega, for three points, which this would mean Kimmy would still win. Yeah. Uh -huh. No matter what. But no matter still, what. But, but we're all winners. Yeah. yeah. Those speared fingers. Our spirits, because they're dead. Y'all are all wrong. Oh, oh, what? Batman has not met Jason Voorhees. Whoa! But he I can has totally met see Voldemort you hunting a little like and Harry Houdini. Ah. Mm -hmm. Explain oh, Voldemort. Yeah. It's the Lego Batman movie. It's, it's the, the Lego, Lego Batman. That means Kimmy is our greatest detective. Yeah. And he's the winner. Oh, yeah. Damn, give her a oh, yeah. Yes. yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Wow, yeah. she's such an honor. Winning. She can't, she can't keep getting away with this. <laughs> no, congratulations. Thank you. Oh, wow. Thank you. I just know a lot about the Batman. What yeah, can yeah. I say? Yeah. The Batman and the Batmen, and uh, yeah, because there's plural, Batman, yeah. and uh, yeah, that's it. I'm a winner.
Thanks. Ooh, <laughs> and thank you to the viewers who are watching us. And uh, congratulations to everyone who played along and got them all right. Yeah. Now, if you're so charged up on these videos and you're like, I need to see more, you can click right here, there's a video. You can click right here, there's a video. And if I remember correctly, this should be a link to the merch. Go ahead and get some of that. And uh, hit that bell, subscribe, and come back. We love you.